Okay, I know everyone's got a burning question in their mind. Can we make three-phase power portable? Uh, you know, let's uh, let's find out. We're going to find out together. I honestly haven't plugged anything in. Uh, that is my job site uh, generator. It's a 6.5 kV. Uh, but let's uh, let's get that thing started. We're going to plug in the uh, amp by American Rotary. We're going to make sure our breaker's on here. Then we're going to start the phase converter. Okay, so it runs. I heard the generator kind of glitched a little bit when we're charging those uh, uh, capacitors in there, but that's alright. And now what we're going to run today is a, uh, a Baldor grinder. And we've already got, I use the same twist locks that they use uh, that come on the amp. So we're gonna plug this dude in here. And give it a twist and lock it, make sure our breaker's on. Uh, we should be ready to run. There you go. That's a portable three phase power. needs a utility company, right? Pretty good. And we're still spooling down here. So there you have it. Portable three-phase power. It can be done. Hey guys, welcome to RZ. My name's Stan. And today uh, we got two of the prizes in for the upcoming summer bash. We got a 10 horse uh, rotary phase converter. It's the AMP model by uh, American Rotary. And we got a five horsepower version. Uh, these are going to be given away at the uh, summer bash. Um, they're wonderful. I pulled them off the skid, took them out of the box, plugged them into a welding outlet, and uh, they're plug and play. Just fire them up. Now, they're very quiet too. I got two of them running here, which is going to multiply the sound, but uh, uh, completely bearable, and I can actually shoot video uh, with these things running, so they're, they're not unbearable at all. I've heard some really loud phase converters out there, but uh, check out the amp by American Rotary, and uh, we'll see you when Hellfreeze is over.